Welcome to Game Tato. Today I have my Blinks three-way comparison video between the Xbox, the 360, and the One X. I want to give a very special, special, special thank you to Mad Little Pixel, Virgil Kellogg, Pop Stobun, Colin Ames, and an extra special special super thank you so much to puritan 007 for donating the xbox and the games to mad little pixel i can't believe what you did out of the kindness of your heart and it's something that's just so special to me i i can't believe it nobody's ever done anything like that for me i can't even talk about the three-way comparison now let's just show the 360 and it's a drastic improvement over the, the original Xbox, it really is. To go from 480 to that was incredible, but then you get the X and you get that 4K resolution and the pixel density is just clear. The filtering is clear. There is no stair stepping. And then you go back to the original Xbox and you just get this bluttered, muddled mess and it just looks terrible for today's gamer. Like, Xbox is bringing all these old games from 2001, 2003, up, even up until 2005, and really updating them to the 2019, 2018 standard that PC gamers have come accustomed to. But they're doing that in the living room, and this is stupendous. Now let's get that comparison between the X and the 360, and then let's get them both out of here with the One X, please. Actually, let's get that three-way because you can see the clarity in the text. It's unbelievable. I don't even know what to say what this team is doing. I could, I could say the same thing about every video, but whatever. I'm just more blown away by Mad Little Pixel and Puritan 007. You guys are heroes. I've been working my butt off learning all this software and I've been doing everything I can to try to improve. And you guys just... I don't even know what to say. You guys are incredible. And this game is incredible. I'm so glad to be playing it on a modern console. Let's get that 360 down there in the right spot so we can have some kitties. Now, Mad Little Pixel, in your video, some person, I'm not going to mention them, but they said I wasn't posting enough cats in my videos, so I thought this 3A comparison of Blinks the Time Cat would be the perfect cat video. Wow, look at that cutscene, just the improvement. B1Q64. I might have to do a Conquerors the Bad Fur Day triple comparison next. I think that's the way things are leaning. First we do cats, then we do squirrels. Well, first it was dragons in the Panzer Dragon. But I can't believe that Xbox is giving us the ability to play between the Xbox, the 360, the One and the One X, and then being able to upscale all these resolutions depending on what console you have is just so genius. If you could just have exclusive new gen content, Xbox with this backwards compatibility could be dominating the market and you already got the best controller. I'm sorry, like the DualShock 4 is a very good improvement over the DualShock 3, but compared to the Xbox One controller or the 360 controller, the DualShock 3 and 4 both suck. So we have this console that just doesn't have exclusives, but it's given us this backwards compatibility. Look at the 360 on the left. It's just not even close. And you can't even see what I'm seeing in my living room on my 4K TV. It looks better than this. Now I think what I should do is just talk about where I want to improve in Game Tato. Because I have a lot to do, I have a lot of projects that I want to show you guys. I think we need to go on Google SketchUp and show you guys how to design your own joysticks and arcade machines in some upcoming videos um, later tonight. I'm going to stay up as late as I can and get the energy, but I want to talk about how the Duke is a major fiasco and uh, GameStop launched. They blotched the launch, so I can't even say it right. They only got three per store. And I had a couple GameStop employees bring me out receipts just to show me the heinousness of the only three Hyperkin 
Dukes per store. This is a major travesty. Why would Duke, I mean, why would GameStop even get the exclusive rights to the Duke? I can't even talk. This is so terrible. And I just, it makes me mad as like a Game Tato owner and just a gamer that loves games. Like, why would you limit love on these games so you can hike up the prices? It's terrible. But I'm so glad I got to do this 3 a comparison. I love you guys. This is Game Tato signing out. Peace. I love you, motherfucking. I shouldn't even cuss, but Mad Little Pixel, you're a G, Paps the Band, Virgil Kellogg, Colin Ames, and I just want to give a special thank you to Puritan007 for donating that. You are a saint. I can't even believe the love that you guys are showing towards my channel, and it just makes me want to work so much harder. Thank you guys so much for watching. Like and subscribe. I don't even need to ask. You guys are the best. Thank you.